Hi everyone, Jared here from IMD, and in this video, I'm going to walk you through some of the core features of our patient engagement platform that will allow clinicians and their healthcare support teams to immediately start having more informative, engaging patient conversations at the point of care. This video will give you a comprehensive overview of the platform and, along the way, I'll point out some other great features we've built into our tool. If you're looking for more in-depth information on these features, or specific ways in which IMD can address the needs of your team, check out the rest of IMD's video library, where we dive a little deeper into the specific use cases. That said, let's jump right in. Healthcare professionals can access the IMD platform via any web browser by heading to app.imdhealth.com and entering their sign-in credentials. Once logged in, our healthcare professional user is taken to their clinic's private landing page. Every organization from small clinics or pharmacies to larger institutions and hospitals has an opportunity to customize this experience for their team, including adding branding, custom welcome pages, and adding or removing features to suit their needs. This is a good time to mention that IMD was designed with both healthcare professional and patient in mind. EMRs can be complicated and difficult to use with an ugly user interface and steep learning curve. IMD's interface is designed to be approachable and clean and easy to use regardless of the type of the device that you're using. If you take a look at the menu bar on the left of the screen, each of the blue tiles represent additional features from surveys to digital enrollment to e-learning programs. You can learn more about these features in some of our other videos. For now, let's focus on the core feature of IMD, patient education. To begin educating a patient, the healthcare practitioner clicks the Educate a Patient tile on the left-hand menu. After entering some quick information about the patient they are talking to, the healthcare professional clicks the Start button to proceed. Note that entering a patient's email at this point is optional. If the patient isn't comfortable giving it, they don't need to. Our patient education session is now live. You can confirm that by looking at the top right of the screen, where you'll see a timer that tracks the length of the conversation, the demographic information of the patient that we're talking to, and the number of patient resources that have been reviewed during the session. A typical patient education flow follows three steps. Number one, find the topic that we want to talk about. Then, educate visually with IMD's patient-friendly resources, which include diagrams, videos, and brochures. And finally, send the patient home with a summary of everything that was discussed during the session. Let's look more closely at step one. When it comes to finding the topic that you want to talk about with a patient, you have a few options. First, you can navigate to conditions, procedures, and anatomical topics by using the IMD body navigator on the left-hand side of the screen. Secondly, you can use the search bar to begin typing in the topic you wish to find. IMD Smart Search will suggest topics as you type. And finally, you can access topics via IMD's shortcut tiles in the center of the screen. Shortcuts are a great way to get to your most commonly used topics quickly. The first time you log in, IMD will list some recommended shortcuts based on the specialty focuses you indicated when you set up your account. You are also able to set your own shortcuts as well. For this demo, I'm going to use IMD Search and look for ulcerative colitis. We are now ready for step two, visual education. What you see now is IMD's topic workbench. All information pertaining to the topic can be found within the left menu. In general, the flow of this menu is designed to answer the top questions a newly diagnosed patient will have regarding their condition. Namely, what is it? What symptoms can I expect from it? What can I, myself, do about it? What can you, the healthcare professional, do to treat it? And where can I go for support and learn more? Navigation in the topic workbench is as simple as choosing the item of interest from the left-hand menu. For example, we can dive a bit deeper into IMD's lifestyle and understanding folders and you'll find some great patient-friendly content from IMD partner organizations, such as this two-minute animated video from the Canadian Digestive Health Foundation. At this point, we've had the opportunity to view and share with the patient some great content about their condition, as well as suggesting some further reading and next steps to focus on. We're ready to wrap up our consultation and send them home. It's time for step three, 
the session summary. You may have noticed as we browsed through the various resources that our session tracker at the top right was keeping note of everything we looked at. And in addition to keeping track of our time, we can see here that we've looked at a number of resources. At the end of a consultation, click the pink button to complete your patient session. A summary of everything you talked about with your patient will be displayed. From here, you can further tailor the content you would like to send to the patient by Xing out any of the non-essential items. You can also include a quick note for your patient. And if they provided their email at the beginning of the session, it will be reproduced here. Otherwise, hopefully they see the value in this information being sent to them now and will gladly provide it. All that is left for the patient to do is agree to IMD's terms and conditions and we're ready to send. When your patient opens the email they received at the end of their consultation with you, they will be able to view all of the resources you opted to include in the email on their own device. At this point, you are also returned to the IMD home screen, ready to start again with your next patient. And with that, you have just witnessed a typical patient consultation on the IMD Health platform. This just scratches the surface of what is possible with IMD. Be sure to check out our other videos in our learning series by visiting and subscribing to our YouTube channel. We are always adding video demos of new and exciting IMD features, as well as exploring ways in which IMD can set you and your practice up for success. If you'd like to learn more about how IMD's patient engagement solutions can help you, click the link below. Thanks and have a great day.